In this video, we'll briefly look at Amazon Lex and how to use it for a conversational user interface or a chatbot. And I'll also give you some basic Python code to run inside um, a Lambda function to do session management and some dialogue management. So if you go to the AWS management console, you will see Amazon Lex there. If I open it, um, you'll see my different bots are here. Um, we can look at the book trip bot. This is not a integrated bot, so it returns the, the parameters. Um, so I've got different slots I want to uh, catch. I want pick up city, pick up date, return date, driver age, and car time. So if I build this chatbot. So here we've got a, a single a single intent um, and inside, inside it, this intent we've got these slots we want to capture. If I say um, um, the car in Lisbon in Saturday and Dropping it um, at George, I am 18 and I want a sedan. Here we can see that um, I didn't give a return date. <laughs> the pickup date is picked up, the pickup city, the driver age, and the car type was missed um, and it's prompting me for the return date. If I clear this, so what I find interesting is that with AWS Lex, um, it, the pickup city can be contextual. So I've got a pickup city, I've got Amazon US city, but the pickup city is defined as a contextual entity within the intent. So if I, um, I'm getting the car in, I'll suppose, which is a sort of African city, it does pick up the, the city name as Nell Sprite. So in that sense, it's, it's truly contextual. If I go back, um, and let's just quickly look at an integrated journey. So I get, I've got a get slot spot. Right, so this is just a bot that asks my name. So I've got one, um, one slot or one entity. Um, I use Amazon Great Bit to written first name and it asks what's your name. As simple as that. But here's the interesting part and I'll share this code in the notes as well. You can see uh, it doesn't return the parameters of the client actually goes to AWS Lambda function. And this you will need when you want to um, manage session variables and manage the dialogue and and um, do sanity checks. So if we view the simple Lex function, and if you go to AWS Lambda. You will see the runtime is Python 3.8. Um, and this is the most basic code. So what we do here, we set session variables. So I've just got two session session variables called key one, key two, with value, value one and value two. Um, and also we um, if it's fulfilled, we just return the message that says you are now is intent name and the entity is entity. And here's the critical part where we capture um, we put a variable here entity and a variable called intent, and this is where we capture the current um, value of the slot or entity name. 
and the current intent name. So if you go back here, so this is you need to look for that text in next chatbot. So if I go to test chatbot and say hi, and I say Intent you are in now is called is good information. Yes, indeed, the intent you in. And then the entity is Corbus, and that is the name that was captured. I mean, it can then be used within my Amazon Dex chatbot. So, this is just a very simple example to show you how to capture variables and actually return a dialogue and variables and session variables back into into next and then obviously we can go to channel channels and we've got facebook here kick slack twilio sms and we can um, deploy our application into production so here's some very basic code and i'll um, put it in the notes and you can make use of it